this down before Just I'm Just a dropping. second. Okay, okay, okay. I thought you were going to be gone longer. Hey, what do you got in the box? Oh, it's for our Christmas tree. See, when I dropped that off home, I uh, boxed up some of these ornaments and uh, <laughs> a few things I made when I was a kid, and I sent them to myself. <laughs> Aww. Yeah, I wanted to get a tree while you were in Australia, but I... Well, I, I didn't know if... if you were going to be back in time. Want miss our first Christmas together? Yeah. Hasn't seemed much like Christmas. Well, it's about to change. So we'll start our first tree off with these, and then each year we'll add a few things of our own. That's just how I always pictured it. So where do you want to get a tree from? Well, there's a, there's a handsome blue spruce in Edward Quartermain's backyard. Do we have a saw? Dad, is Helmet yeah. H-E-L-M-E-T? Yeah, it is. But... Wait a minute. Were you in my closet? Am I getting one for Christmas? Now, that was just a box, you understand? you got to understand something. Christmas presents do not come from closets. They come from Santa Claus. Some kids at school say there is no Santa. Mira, mejito, you can't believe what you hear at school. They told me I could be president. $85. Well, for these two? A little steep, don't you think? Where else are you going to find such beautiful wreaths like this on Christmas Eve? Mira, este garlands? Oh, I smell this, huh? Wait, Mike, Mike, wait, wait, wait. Uh, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Not you and it's not Robin, it can wait. Hey, will you quit stalling? Come on. What do I need a tree for, Mike? What? One day, what's the point? God, look at the size of this one. It's not going to fit in the elevator. Look, you can keep it up through New Year's, you can keep it up through Easter. All I know is the four of us are decorating a tree tonight. Every other place in town is either closed or sold yeah. out. Okay, right. okay, good, good. Because I want this one right here. Dad, can we get this too? Now, it's very important to remember who this Christmas party is for. The sick kids. That's right, honey. And some of them may be very sick. You know, they may be in wheelchairs, or some of them may have tubes attached to them. I don't have to stare, Mommy. Oh, honey, I know. Thank you. Don't mind me. You know, I just get excited. You know, apart from the nurse's ball, this event is always the biggest event of the year at the hospital. Where's the party? You and Amy have always handled the pediatric ward party, and now Amy is on personal leave since the funeral, and, well, you've had a lot going for you, yourself. And so we got a couple of the children to make a few things, and I got some decorations from the doctor's lounge. It's pretty lame, isn't it? <laughs> well, you know, all right. Let's not panic. How much time have we got? Well, we've got two hours. We're fine. Are we? Oh, good. Mom, we can bring decorations from home. Honey, that's brilliant. It's exactly what we'll do. Okay, Audrey, yes. can you pull down a dietary and see what they can whip us up for a party, but you might have to tug on their heartstrings ah, for a little yes, bit. Ah, yes, I can do that. Okay, what can I do? Uh, actually, you know what? Call Felicia at the Brownstone and tell her if she goes to my upstairs hallway to my way back closet, you know, behind the guest room. Stay right here, honey. I'll be right back. She'll find this big box of Christmas lights and decorations, and please, please, could she bring them? Got it. Excuse me. <sighs> oh, good. What? Reinforcements. We need you. Come on. On my Lucas. Keep an eye on Lucas. Thank you. No, 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 Justice. It's still crooked, isn't it? I don't like that tree. Isn't it? Hey, why are you dressed like a spy? I am a spy. Oh. Oh, I got the ornaments. What? Finally. Well, wait, 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 wait. No, no, nobody here was showing any interest, and so the florist just came in and did this. I know. Well, maybe we're getting a late start this year, but these are the quarter oh, main Monica. heirlooms. They're going on that tree. Huh. Okay. Emily, you are in charge of finding a perfect place for these. Oh, I remember that one from last year. Oh, I love it. It's so delicate. Yeah, it, it was my mom's favorite, too. <laughs> when I think about all of our old Christmas stuff burned at Warren House. Yeah, well, now, uh, from now on... These uh, old Christmas things will be yours and Justice's things, too. Hmm? Oh, no. What? Uh, what is it? This was a, a dove that Jason made in camp that summer, remember? Hmm. Uh, hello? Hello. 
Alan, how come you're not home to help us finish decorating the tree? Well, yeah, we're going to be there, but it's not till later. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, my. Um, yeah, no problem. We can do that. All right, okay. We're on our way. What? Why? Where are we on our way to? Well, somehow, the children's party at the hospital fell through the cracks. Oh. You're kidding me. It's been canceled? Oh, Steve will turn in his grave. No, it is not canceled. They do need presents, they need decorations, and they need a tree. Well, we have enough decorations <laughs> for several trees. Yeah. And enough lights that we'll never use. There must be at least a dozen poinsettias in the house. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, there are 16. Just watered them. <laughs> okay, everybody, let's pack up. Well, I think I should get changed. I think so, young lady, because those poor children will think you're the Grim Reaper. Where's Ned when we need him? Oh, what would Don like in apparel? Cup of holiday eggnog. If I glue my arteries shut tonight, what will I do New Year's Eve? I'll have a double martini, very, very dry. Just pour the gin and visualize vermouth. You got it. Merry Christmas. How can you tell? Bah, humbug. Poppycock. Infernal rubbish. Balderall. I'll drink to that. But Tommy, we already have a tree. And hey, uh, I, I, I did see it first. Oh, wait a minute. Rule of thumb is Christmas tree has to be bigger than you are, Sonny. But Grandpa doesn't have one. What? If we put this one in his office, can he see it up in heaven? Sure he can. Everybody in heaven's got x-ray vision. Shame on you. Yeah. Tell me your, your grandfather would probably like that a lot. And hey, you know what? My old man, he, he won't let me get it anyway. Okay, I'll throw in the tree for all the angels and the saints. Jose! Will you help these gentlemen, even if they don't know what they want? You need lights, ornaments, Santa Claus hats. It's fine. This one's fine. All right. Wait a minute. It's, 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 but it's not symmetrical, so. Mike, you won't go for a fake tree, but then you want something that looks fake. Well, what is it you want? Well, you need it's easier to vacuum them up. Four beetles last summer, two weeks ago, up like a torch. Fantastic. How much? How much is it? Maria. Maria. A hundred and fifty. <laughs> oh, fine, you mean fifty. It. Fifty bucks, right? Right. Plus a hundred. <laughs> That's highway robbery. Sixty bucks tops. Ever hear of supply and demand? I got the supplies, I make the demands. You ever hear of the Better Business Bureau? Mike, put a, put a sock in it. Come, come on. What are you, you're just ah! guilty. Uh. I mean, come on, look what she's pulling now. I mean, this is a con artist. What are you, jealous of being pregnant, the only con you never pulled? Can we just leave here, please? No. Did I hear what you just... Did I hear right what you just said? An hour ago. Your water broke? Yes. 